quiet community of Stytown is in shock tonight. A 20 year old woman there says a man attacked her from behind early this morning and tried to rape her. CBS 2's Matt Kozar is live on the east side with more on that. Matt. Jessica, Stuyvesant Town is a close knit community. People have lived here for decades. They have their own security force, which is why people we talk to say they are surprised this happened. Take a look at these images of the suspect just released by police. In this surveillance video, you can see the suspect casually strolling across the avenue just minutes before the attack happened. He's wearing a blue shirt and dark pants. Police also released these photos of the man who they are searching for at this hour. In one of the pictures, he's wearing a tank top. Now, according to investigators, the suspect approached a 20 year old woman from behind around 5 this morning near the Stuyvesant Oval, which is in the center of the complex. They say he grabbed her neck, causing her to pass out. As he attempted to rape her, police say a good Samaritan stepped in, intervened, and called 911. The man fled on foot and was seen running towards 2nd Avenue. We spoke with Grace Sullivan. She has lived in Stuytown for 42 years. She tells us she is shocked this happened. I left the house at six this morning to go to the beach. So, and you know, no one's out around then. So, um, oh. yeah, I'm going to feel a little bit unsafe for a while, but I'm, it's such a rare incident here that I'm, I'm hoping they catch the guy and, um, and I'm just going to be smarter and more careful and maybe always leave at my front entrance of my building where there's more people and stores. Now, Sullivan told us that the management company released uh, messages to everyone this morning, warning them to be on guard. As for the victim, she had cuts to her hands and her face or elbows. She was rushed to an area hospital. Reporting live from the Lower East Side, Matt Kozar, CBS 2 News. All right, Matt, thank you.